Hey you guys, um, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how I did this on my emulator and the code that I uh, have used to make these widgets. So first we have the scaffold and I have my up bar, I made a title for my up bar text uh, text widget which is widget this one then, uh, then on my body I had a center widget I had first my um, container I had my container and then I made a decoration for my container this as you can see in my scaffold then I had my image as the background of my container now in order to use this you have to go to your assets folder if you don't have an assets folder you can make an assets folder then place there your image after placing the image you go to your pubspec.yaml file and then uncomment the assets here I have to be careful because this is a uh, indention sensitive so we have to make sure that it is aligned and the dish dosh is on the second letter S and then you can use this to uh, have uh, a general setting uh, to your of your assets now let's go back to our code if you have set that on a pop spec and you already have the, an image inside your assets folder you create this folder manually and you place the image here then you can use this code image asset image and then I tried to change it to the box fit to cover so it would cover the container the radius um, border radius only which is for the top left this area here and the top right here so I'm uh, I'm setting the radius to circular 40.0 because this is double not an integer so I have decimal point here then you can see it here now next I made a column what you can see here on my screen is that these buttons are in front of the container that is because I wrapped them using the stock I wrapped them using the stock uh, widget so now I made a column and set it main, alax main axis alignment to center then in, on my children property I have the elevated button this one in order to style my, my elevated button I use the style property and then the elevated button that style from background color the shadow color the elevation here the shape um, also the radius minimum size if you want to adjust the size here and the side color it's like the border and then the on press property whenever you click this one you, you will navigate to a different page so I have here because this button has a child property and I use a text widget animated notch bottom bar then I use a size box have the space here then the elevated button that icon this one you can place here an icon and a text then I also made a container for the text button that means the text button I wrapped it with the container and then I have here the margin the height the margin query size of uh, will adjust based on screen size 
that's why I use this code for the width. Then decoration, I decorated it the same with um, the on press property. Then I have here text button that icon. So it has an icon, but I can place there a label which is for the password. And the last one is the outline button. Um, it has no background, it has no color. So it's it's like only the border because it's an outline button. So that's it for this tutorial. I hope you like it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and share as well.